Hey, it's John Wilkerson from Struggling for Purpose. I discovered recently that IMDb is now accepting podcasts in their database. Uh, what's interesting is that it actually started two months ago. That, that's neither here nor there. Thanks to James Cridlin from podnews.net for pointing this out. I finally figured out how to submit so I'm going to run a little tutorial here. I'm going to do the best that I can. It's very complicated. It's not easy to do, but hopefully with this video, it'll help you out. All right, let's uh, switch over to my browser and we'll go from there. Okay, so you have to use their submission form. There will be a link to it over at strugglingforpurpose.com slash IMDB submission. These instructions will be there as well because you're going to need these instructions as well in order to get through it. So we're going to open up this second tab here and go to adding a new title. So I've already added the Wired Homeschool, so I'm going to add Struggling for Purpose. I cannot type because I'm being recorded. Struggling for Purpose. It is made for TV. It has been released and I am the producer, director, and writer. And it's gonna, you're gonna hit this and then it's gonna say, okay, well, what type of TV? This is a TV series. And it was originally released in 2011. I believe that's right. That can be corrected later. It says the year range is invalid. This is gonna happen if it's ongoing, click ongoing, recheck it again and it'll let you through to the next screen. Now, this is going to happen every single time you do this. It, like I said, the form is very complicated. Now, it'll say it, you might have a, a title that's similar to a TV show, and that's fine, um, but you need to be very careful. Look through this list, click that it is not an existing title, and then recheck these updates. And now you'll get to where the uh, most difficult part of this comes in. There's mandatory information. That information is listed over here with, when it comes to the keywords and a link to the podcast. So you need to choose the country of origin. For me, it's the United States. Then come down here to the miscellaneous link. Put in the link to your website. Like I said, I can't type. And use the description that they ask you to provide, which is website, full audio, or if it's a video, website, full video. All right, so that's the miscellaneous link that they require. So we've got one thing done. That's on this list up here. You need three items for the basic identifying information. So here we are. Mandatory information is this here. We got this. We're going to put 2011 again. Our miscellaneous link. Basic identifying information. Again, country is one that counts. And you can choose, and I'm choosing English. You can choose genre and pick the one that um, works the best for you. Directors are required, so I am already in here, but when you add your name, you, you may need to add a new entry and provide additional information, and I'll show you what that looks like later. You can choose to put a budget in if you want to. Under official site, I always, again, I put the same thing as I did before. And I'm using this description here, official site, that they tell you you should use. All right, so basic identifying information. It says you need three things up here director I've chosen, the official site. Uh, you need three 
cast major credits, three major credits. So I'm going to add a cast member, which is me. I'm going to add a writer, which is me. And I'm going to add a producer, which is me. Um, and then there are going to be keywords that I want to add. Keywords, I want to add two keywords. Now, again, now we do this, recheck these updates and it's going to show you this form. It looks like there's a mistake. You see here the ones that I've already submitted are in green. It takes them, it accepts them. And now we need to come over here, major credit. Well, it's me again. And I'm putting myself in as self. And I am the writer and I am the producer. Now it requested specific keywords. Category podcast is one of them. And audio only is the other one. All right. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to remove this and just put in here uh, Jimbo Johnson and I'm going to submit it. I'm going to recheck for updates. All right. So what's going to happen down here is for Jimbo Johnson, it's going to ask me, hey, do you mean one of these or is it a different person? If it's a different person, you select this and it'll create a new person. So now I have entered everything and it's probably looking for more. Um, this is not an existing title. You got to look. OK, here. Warning. Warning understood. So you got to accept the warning there. That's that's been clicked there. We're looking for green throughout. And it looks like we do. I forgot to accept the warning. Make sure you click on that. I'm going to submit it again. And now all my information is green. You keep Click, you keep going through this, rechecking and rechecking, making sure you have all the right information. It's going to be difficult for you to get it all right the first time because you have to add a new title. You have to add yourself and things like that. We Now that we have all green, you see that our submission button appears. And now I can submit these updates and it will go through and I will receive an email stating that I've successfully submitted my podcast. So that's how you submit your podcast to IMDb. I apologize. I know this is confusing. It's very difficult. You just need to work your way through it. If I ever get this down 100%, I will be happy to create another video for you. But this is the way you do it for now. Hopefully they'll streamline this for podcasters and we can get our podcast submitted a lot easier. Hey, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel. Give it a like. And hey, if you're subscribed, why not ring that bell? Because it might uh, notify you the next time I put a video up. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.